Hey everyone, welcome back to Playcrastination Population 127. Today is a great day, you wanna know why? Because the win streak is a zero, which means we get a fresh start, which means we get to try to do a new streak, which means no more Eden, no more random bullcrap that gives us Maggie every two runs and never gives us Isaac. So, uh, if you didn't watch my WAP this week, uh, which I think just came out yesterday. Uh, uh, a lot of you guys have been asking for shorter and shorter videos, and this whole randoming thing, getting Maggie every single time, having 58 minute runs with no damage, uh, where we the only good item we get is Deadeye, and it still takes two hits to kill the tiniest poop, there's gonna be no more of that. To try to speed things up, we're gonna be sticking to just basically the basics. We're gonna go back to playing as Isaac, which we haven't done in... Uh, we were at a 20 win streak. That was our 21st run. We literally didn't literally didn't play as Isaac the entire streak. Uh, so here we go. This is my reward. G1 T F X B N C. Now, the reason Isaac makes it a lot easier is a he just starts. The starting stats we're starting with now are probably already better than what uh, we were. At pretty much 50% of that entire last run. Seems like there's like a lot of champions in here. Um, so that's one reason. I, oh, okay, he just blasted me into the fire. If I ended up losing this, that would be so funny. Um, so that is one reason that uh, that Isaac is a little bit better. Second reason is obviously he starts with a D6. Um, D6 means you can re-roll the health upgrades, which we seem to get after every single boss fight, because why would you get anything else other than a health upgrade? It's so great. Uh, we get to re-roll that into potentially something great, like a magic mushroom or something. Uh, so there there are just so many more avenues, if you will. Boulevards of Broken Dreams were the last run. These are avenues. They're different. There's so many more avenues for positive things to happen in your run. Also, uh, you know, it's a lot more likely you're going to just basically go out of control and get a great run, which is something we're interested in if we'd like to... Uh, most, most of you guys said that you would prefer to see videos of, like, sub-30. And if that is the case, uh, that's going to require a lot more, a lot more speedy play, a lot less methodical stuff. But to, you know, play speedy and not have to worry about losing, you have to get decent stuff. <laughs> so that is our hope of what we're going to be doing on this run here. Hopefully we can make the first one uh, a solid one. I really don't like this champion spawner guy down here. Yeah, I really do not like him as I have mentioned a couple times. Uh, I'd like to end his life here. Go ahead, he's going to go to... Ah, uh, you... Think you can get away? You think you can escape? You cannot. Nobody can escape from the run we had last time. Golden bombs, absolutely. Go ahead and find the secret room here as well as get a key. Did not find the secret room. We get blank card. You, you tempt me. Blank card's a great item, but we're going to go ahead and re-roll it. Get fear shot. Still not the item that we're looking for. Um, so let's go ahead down here and pick up this, uh, this little battery charge over here. See if we can find the secret room in here potentially. No. No secret room, huh? Guess it could potentially be down here as well. We'll go ahead and pick up this battery charge. I know I said we were going to play faster, and this is like the slowest you could possibly play running back and forth picking up battery charges. But you know what? I'm excited to have the D6. We actually get to reroll things, and it's great. And we're going to reroll, and we're going to get Dark Bum. Dark Bum. That's why you reroll, man. That's why you reroll. It's not going to help us offensively, but defensively, it's Spirit Hearts for the rest of the game, and it's just. I don't think we got Dark Bomb on like any of our runs in like the last 20, so it's already a great day. <laughs> Go ahead and blow everything up. You never know the off chance you might find a, a, you know, a crawl space of some sort down under here. Not looking like it. If it's under that one rock over there, then I deserve to not find it. Still nothing there. We could blow up the pots, try to get a little bit of money, but uh, you know. My, my determination to find one of these rooms only has so many bounds. Uh, and we basically hit it right there. So let's go ahead and continue down. We're not in a great spot right now, um, but we're, just, I mean, we are already, like, just look how fast we can kill these things. It's great. It doesn't take, like, eight hits to, to kill them. I love it. And then we didn't get a tears down pill. Oh, I mean, we still got another floor to go, so we can still get a tears down pill pretty early, but we will not have a reroll for the boss fight, so uh, when we get stuck with an HP upgrade, as the, this is also the largest floor ever. Um, Gotta check for secret room. Could be, if you have infinite bombs, there's no reason not to. So I'm guessing it's gonna be right here. Are you kidding me? Where in the world is this thing? Um, could be like right here. Okay, could be like right here. Oh my gosh, we have finally discovered it. It's gonna give us this. We're gonna blow up these guys. Do not turn into a greed. We get counterfeit penny, which is just fine. Gonna help us hopefully get to five cents before the floor is donezo. 
Dunzo Funzo, so that we can get, uh, okay, infinite bombs here is real nice. All right, do not want to go this way. Would much rather go this way. Infinite bombs means we should be using them against, excuse me, I stepped on creep. All right, that is my own mistake. Oh my god, we get a tinted rock. Dude, life is good. Life is freaking good. We get a key. We get this. We get another bomb up here. We get some spirit hearts. We get some of this action. We open this up. We get some money. Five cents for the next floor and more bombs. We go ahead and take this card. We get the moon card. We'll save that for the next floor. Second secret room probably right here. Not right there. It could be down in the middle of this one. It could be down with the sickness right about here. Okay, I was gonna say, if it wasn't there, I... Oh, Dark Bomb. Dark Bomb is about to go on a freaking... And we also got enough money for another battery charge. Thank you. Not so much for the spider. Okay, I'd like to leave, so... Blind Rage, probably better than Counterfeit Penny uh, in the long run. Because uh, money kind of becomes obsolete after the sixth floor, but... Okay, we are going real slow here, and I apologize for that. But we will speed it up right quick. Go ahead and jump up here, buddy. Go ahead and jump up here if you could. Yeah, go ahead and fall right on that. Go ahead and fall right on that. Golden bombs, man. Golden bombs. What do we get? Oh, it's a, it's a range upgrade. Ooh, just kidding. It's a tears upgrade and a spirit heart. So long. Farewell. I love the D6, man. D6 comes and saves you so many times. All right, we got a tears upgrade. We are firing faster than we were on the entirety of the last run, which is amazing. I'm not gonna. I'm not one to live in the past, you know. So I'm not gonna complain about the last run, you know, forever. Uh, but you know, I feel like for a little bit at least. Okay, battery charge is nice to have. See if we can get a nice little. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. Into that, maybe we can bomb our way into. You know, I was hoping this would be like an item room or something. It is not. We get more spirit hearts from this. Can we just talk about like the HP that we have? Because this this is what happens when you play as Isaac, and I don't know why. This is just what happens. You just win. Five cents came through in the clutch for us. We do, in fact, get an arcade. Not really one we're that interested in, though. So, But Dark Bum is interested in grabbing those and paying out with yet another Spirit Heart. Almost at full health already. It is such a good day to be alive, guys. I like this. I like runs like this because I can be a lot more... I'm, I'm, I'm generally a pretty optimistic, happy person, but it's just... I mean, maybe I'm just whining. But it seems like, yeah, Daddy Long Legs. God, that would have helped last run so much. We'll go ahead and just. Now we're gonna get a deal with the devil, and we're gonna trade away HP anyway. So, thank you so much. We want to make sure we have this battery charge or this uh, D6 ready for the deal with the devil, because it makes it so much more likely. I mean, unless we just have the same luck we did, dude. Look at that. Unless you have the same ruck, ruck. <laughs> unless you. Oh, you gotta take lucky rock. Gotta take Lucky Rock. Uh, unless you have, we have the same luck we did last time, we start off with three red chests, one of them being a Tears Down pill. Uh, but, uh, you know, this curse room being bad, I don't even care because we're at full HP. Last run, something like that would have peeved me off, but the game has already given us so much, there's not too much we can really feel good about complaining about. There you go, continue on with this room. And now that we're, you know, kind of hit this equilibrium point, now there's no reason to not go quickly. We can check out our shop real fast. We will absolutely take both of these, BFF and Hive Mind. You know, with uh, with the D6, it's a lot more likely you're going to become Guppy, just because, you know, you, you get a lot more chances to reroll, deal with the devil items, curse room items, whatever. Oh, that's unfortunate. And those often turn into Guppy items, so it makes it a lot more likely. There you go. Thank you, Dad. BFF Daddy Longlegs is going to synergize so nicely. We may reroll that if what's in here is bad. You wouldn't. You wouldn't. You wouldn't. I mean, the game can't give us everything. We can't be super greedy. Super greed. Take the tears up. We go to the next floor. Um, but this run is already... If we were in this spot, like if we had this exact... Eh, maybe a little bit more thing. No, I, I think with Daddy Longlegs BB BFF... I think if we were in this exact spot on the last run, we would have won. And that is me being 100% honest. It's just, it, it, it's, it's good. It makes me happy. I'm, I'm happy to be alive again. I almost hated the game for a second, but you know what? I'm back. Now, do I think we're going to post sub-30 runs every time we play this game? No. I don't think it's possible. We would have to, I'm too much of a completionist to be able to do that. However, I do plan on posting a lot more, like, I think 40-minute runs are a lot more likely to be able to do, and so I'd like to do stuff like that. Uh, there you go, finish off that guy. Thank you, Daddy Longlegs. Um, but basically, 
if we just go with the mentality that all we need to do is make it to um, item room and shop each floor, if we set that out as a goal for ourselves, make it to the item room, make it to the shop, uh, and then go to the next floor, I mean, this was a bad idea because if we get, uh, unless this man drops a battery charge, please drop a battery charge. For some reason, drop a bat. Yeah, I didn't think he would. No, this is like mirroring the last run exactly. We're getting range upgrades, HP upgrades, and uh, now little Chad. Little Chad, dark bum, actually great. Okay, great synergy though. So we will go ahead and take this tinted rock up here. Maybe give us small rock. Nope, just some more. Yeah, just some more spirit hearts for our whatever. Is little Chad just like perpetually happy? I thought he only does that when he like like I don't know why he's looking so giddy. It's freaking me out a bit. What does that sound? Someone's on fire. Um, in here, yeah, nothing really that worth value. Uh, the only reason I didn't re-roll re uh, Chad is because Dark Bum and hit. No, we don't really need Glass Cannon, so we'll re-roll it. Yeah, we'll go ahead and take Little Steven, because why not? We could have re-rolled it further. Don't really see a point in doing that. I will explore just a tiny bit more. Basically, if you can leave this floor by about 10 minutes, you're in a pretty good spot. Uh, and with... Uh, Lucky Rock, I would like to try to get up to 5 cents before the next floor is done. That golden key would have been nice if we would have come this way initially, but we didn't. Are you gonna come my way? I don't, I don't know. That was not great damage. Would love a bomb. Bomb would be pretty much ideal, yo. Alright, or just give me a dime. That is also pretty ideal. Alright, come on. There you go. Continue out of this. Didn't really need to come in here. Knew it wasn't gonna be anything of value. Did it anyway. I'm a bad boy. What can I say? Oh, I'm a bad boy. Oh, God. All right, let's go. Let's go. This room better pay out with something you just, just dope for me. Okay, I was like, Daddy Long Legs will stomp him. I'll just take the bullets. Should not have done that. Now, we're not super strong. Definitely, you know, damage leaves something to be desired, but still. But still. Great spot. The world card. Oh, my gosh. If we could have got something like that. We did get a bomb from somewhere. I didn't even notice. Um, What do we got here? A magician card. Just pop it. That's the luxury we have on this run. I've also noticed we like never get um, things like uh, what am I what am I trying to say here? We never get uh, you uh, you should have bought me flowers and held your hand. Thank you, all my hours. I don't know if that's not how it goes, but in here we got that chest. Not gonna do that. I will check this last little junction here just in case. Pick up the battery. Why not? Just in case we have a curse room. We don't, so we can just leave with some money. Head down to the next floor. We just never get, I don't know if you've noticed, but we never get Emperor cards. And if, if we do, maybe I'm skipping them or something. But I feel like we never get Emperor cards when I'm playing this game, which is part of the reason it takes so long. Okay, go ahead and continue. Like I said, this isn't going to be a sub-30 run, but it's still, you know, pretty, 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 pretty good. Okay, go ahead and kill that guy. Thank you for the nickel. Thank you for the nickel. Go ahead and, yeah, there you go. Get us down far enough. Dark Bomb's gonna pay out because he's a magician. Um, there is one red chest, so you should open it. Because it could potentially teleport you to a deal with the angel. Who we will destroy. And take his key piece and, uh, re-roll it into something potentially better. So, uh, let's go ahead and do this. This one's the easy one to face, luckily. Like I said, damage upgrades, uh, something we're looking for. Uh, Trinity Shield is just fine. I like Trinity Shield. I'm not going to do the rest of the room. Go ahead and do that one more time. Pop the world card because we can. Take the secret room here. No real need to go to the, uh, the arcade over there since we just got a blood bank. Basically everything we wanted from one right there. A lockdown. You're, you're too rude, game. You, you're too unkind. How could you? Alright, more money, more pills. It's bombs are key, which gives us more bombs so we can blow up more stuff. But it also gets rid of all our keys, which is a sore spot. A bad trip, you know what? The game is, you know, making me a little bit up, up, upset. But it's fine, we're gonna go ahead and get out this way. Kind of a waste of some bombs, but that's okay. Anything in here, just a free HP. We'll go ahead and take... And we know because of the world card, our item room and shop are... Okay, I was inside of them momentarily, but we got out of it alive. If you want to get it alive, oh, oh, run for your life. All that jazz. Uh, This is going to be like a little bit of a dicey. Okay. I was going to say, if that turned into small rock, it'd be like a little bit of a scary... Uh, we have no keys. Now is where it gets, you know, a little upsetting because the bombs for bombs are key pill kinda screwed us just a tiny little teen tiny eensy weensy bit. Another bomb, that's fine. We can get another bombs or key pill. No. Cannot get another bombs or key pill. 
Uh, but we'll continue. No need to go to the item room. All right, go and do this room. Uh, we'll get another reroll before. Oh God, Trinity Shield cannot block explosives, and dank memes can't melt, or jet fuel can't melt dank beam, dank memes. That's my bad. I mixed uh, that one up like a like a margarita. Okay, go on in here. Fight the boss. It's the stain. Don't even care. Look at Daddy Long Legs. Just destroy your HP. All right, please pop up. All right, Daddy Long Legs. We're just hiding behind Trinity Shield because Daddy Long Legs, you seem to be struggling here. Yeah, there you go. There's your target. You hit him. We get Super Bandage. Reroll that. Another HP upgrade, uh, which does warrant going around the floor for a little bit longer, maybe trying to find a key as well as getting another reroll. Uh, I don't want to explore too much more of the floor, but, you know, I do think keys are quite important. We could go to the arcade. Uh, we have enough money that we probably should actually go to the shop instead. I'd like to get two keys, honestly. If we need to, I'll go to the arcade. We can play the machine a little bit. It's going to take a little bit longer, but... Okay, nice, nice. Battery charge is here. Yeah, just go ahead and just take it. Oh, should not have done that. Should not have come into this room after getting the battery charge. We get some more bombs. Making me question my life decisions, game. I'm not a fan. Not a fan at all. Um, we will blow up these mushrooms, try to get a magic mushroom pickup. Somehow did not blow up all four. I thought we would. We'll reroll this HP upgrade, and if it's something good, I'll just go. It's another HP upgrade. The game. The game. On the bright side, by the time we're done with this, we'll have rerolled through every possible HP upgrade in the entire game. Um... But, I mean, that's that's just comical. It's just, if you've watched any episodes on this channel, you know that that's just what we, uh, it's what we do here. We just, we just get that. Left, right, and center. <sighs> left, right, and center. Also, a great name for, uh, my Twister spinoff that I'm trying to come up with. Okay. We'll play these guys. We got the money. We got the money. He's gonna give us Scatoli. Scatoli. Canole. Alright, we did get a lockdown, so we probably shouldn't expect to win on these machines too often, but even if we can get... You know what? I'll just I'll just destroy you, because you might pay out with a key. You pay out with a heart instead. Dark Bum, you want to go get that? I'm going to play this for a little bit. I wish there was a speed up key like there is in my Pokemon Let's Play. It's uh, it's not going to pay out with any keys. This should be a foregone conclusion by now. Uh, it is it is I playing, and uh, you know, it's just not something we expect pick up one of these pennies maybe we get a luck up penny luck up penny please <laughs> luck up penny please all right no luck no dice literally just need a key literally just a key literally just a key just just one key i just want to visit the item room i just want to visit the item room what floor are we on wrong catacombs too boss rush not gonna happen thought we'd maybe make boss rush oh bomb you're, you're so funny oh more money just want me to play you infinite item i got you i got you uh, I'll go down to 15 cents, and then I'm just going to blow it up. So, how you guys been? Hope you're enjoying another bomb. That's funny. Oh, we literally wasted 40 cents on this machine, and it's not going to pay out with a key. All right. Suck on my testicles. Oh, yeah, and then th some more bombs coming out of it. All right, my hands aren't on the keyboard, so I can't really attack that guy. That's actually funny, and so I don't even care. It's not actually funny at all. I'm really peeved off. I found pills. Alright, so we're going to have to miss item room and shop because why wouldn't we? Why The game can't just be kind to you in all regards. It's given us at least like a decent starting point here. We will probably open that on up. Yeah, again, just no keys. I mean, you see what Dark Bomb's going to do, right? It's, it's actually dirty. It's just a dirty, it's a dirty rotten trick. Thank you for the spider. Oh... Also, thanks not so much for the deal with the angels. And no keys. Okay, so we're just going to head down to the next floor. This uh, entire whole exploration thing was a big old waste of time. Unless, you know, last ditch effort, you know, right? <laughs> Why would it be? <sighs> Basically, uh, nothing the game does surprises me at this point anymore. Uh, it doesn't want us to succeed. Maybe we'll get a key for finishing this room, though. You know, that's always a possibility. I like to think positively. Go ahead and come back down, Mega Fatty. Like I said, like to think positively. Game, don't, uh... Okay, you don't need to jump on me like that. It's a little rude. Okay, game, do not uh, make me a fool. Do not make me a fool. It's a penny. We're getting payouts. We're just not getting the payouts that we so desire, which is all right. We'll go ahead and go to the next floor. 
not visiting item room or shop and wasting a lot, a lot, a lot of time. But you know what? We were like 30 minutes on the mom fight last time, so... I mean, we're still two floors away from the mob fight, but if we can get some keys on the next floor, we'll go ahead and take the HP upgrade because we didn't get another reroll either. It's unfortunate, but it fills our HP back up. Could have gone and played the Blood Bank. Did time. Takes too much time. I've been wasting a lot of time on this run. All right. Did not need to come in here. Make my sacrifice not in vain. Give me a key. Give me a key. Give me a key. Not key. Okay, no key, but we do have our charge back on our D6, so whenever we find an item... We can take advantage of that, thank goodness. No key. Continue down here. I'm going to hurt myself for the key because it's worth it. I'm going to hurt myself for this key because it's worth it. We have Dark Bomb. You've seen HP has not, an, has not been an issue on this run. It will not be an issue on this run. So no reason not to sacrifice a little bit for keys, which are a lot more important. Dark Bomb, go ahead and pick that up. Thank you so much. Do not like this room. Yeah, do not like it. Do not like it. But Dark Bomb paid out up here, so that's fine. Okay. Little Chad's paint out left, right, and center. We get uh, this card, which we'll go ahead and re-roll into Blood Rites, which is now what I'm looking for. We'll go back and pick up a battery charge and re-roll that once again. Just continue. Just continue, finish from Pop the I found pills, just to shove it in their faces, basically. This is the... I don't know why. I feel good about this pedestal. This is the pedestal that's really going to break things open. Now that I'm, like, sitting and looking at this run, it's still not that great, and I'm taking a lot of damage, but it is eons, ions, Protons, neutrons, thousands times better than what the last run was. So we cannot complain. Come in this room, gonna hurt ourselves again for the battery charge, and then we'll go reroll that again. If it's another spacebar item, then I'm just gonna take that as the game's way of saying F off. It is not, it's the Pope Hat, which is delicious. It means so much HP, and between Dark Bum, the Miter, and uh, the, the, the Trinity Shield, we're, we're in a really good spot on this run. There's no denying it. Uh, it's not a kind of the blow of the doors off the, the game kind of run I was hoping for after that last run, which was a slog for the entire hour. But, you know, at least this one is winnable. This one is is not even winnable. It's it, I'll go as far to say it's highly winnable. I don't even care about the damage I'm taking because I know we're going to win. Okay, go ahead and blow up that skull. Yeah, give me that penny that I'm not going to go back and pick up. Not a huge fan of all of the big rooms we're having to fight. Um, but that's part of life. You just learn to deal with that, I think. Okay, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, but it's not if we get away from it. This man wants to do damage to us. He's not going to. Daddy Long, like, such a help when we have almost no... I mean, we still have base damage. The game, even though it is being kinder to us and giving us decent items, Daddy Long Legs is a decent item. It's not a damage upgrade, but it's something to do damage for us. So even though the game's not kind enough to be like, here... Here's a way for you yourself to get stronger. 12 runs in a row have awful damage. Uh, at least it gave us some sort of means of winning. Rather than usual, this guy is sucking me in. Okay, just sneak past this guy. He can't touch you. He can't touch you. Thank you so much. Charge is ready. Find the item room slash shop slash both. Spirit heart. I don't... Oh, Pope Pad, I guess, is why that paid out. Okay, we'll go ahead and do this. Try to get a deal with the devil. Probably get a deal with the angel because, you know, life finish this room. I mean, if you're seeing how long it takes us to kill the hollow, that's the kind of spot we're in. Daddy Longlegs, on the other hand, can crush the room real fast. Daddy Longlegs, yeah, go ahead and stomp on that brownie like it's a bug on the sidewalk. I don't really know where that, uh, not alliteration metaphor, I suppose, was, was going. Okay, taking a lot of damage. Daddy Longlegs, if you could go after the actual enemy that's doing damage to us, not the tiny little corns, you gotta stop going after the tiny little corns. Thank goodness we have got him down to a second phase. That's going to end his life. We do get the deal with the devil inside. We get a Krampus fight. Because why wouldn't we? Again, the game is still pushing my buttons. But to a lesser degree. Lump of coal is a damage upgrade, so we'll take it. We'll reroll this. We'll get Pentagram, which is a damage upgrade as well. And we'll go find our item room. Which, of course, why would it be this way? Silly, silly me. We are taking like a lot more damage than I would like to take. Uh, which is nothing to be... Alright, range down. Pills have been terrible this entire time. Um, okay, go ahead and get those guys. Yeah, just get them while they're hugging. Yeah, get them while they're hugging. Nope, nope, get the huggers. Get the huggers. No hugging here, man. This is a no-hugging zone. This is the Binding of Isaac. You cannot be happy. Every single one of these will that explodes will, in fact, turn into a... Yep, the host, because it's what the game is programmed to do. 
program to F you at every available opportunity. Continue down here, find shop all of the big rooms. I'm losing. I, I can't. I can't do the big rooms forever, man. Making me go bonkers. Which is a great game from the Sega Genesis. Alright, we found our shop. We have enough money to partake in said shop, which we would like to do. Kill these guys, thank you. Kill this guy. No, kill that guy, thank you. Another bomb. The bombs are paying out pretty frequently. We'll take Nightlight because we can. Not going to get enough for another charge, unfortunately, unless somehow we get a charge inside our... our, our, our I'm a pirate slash seal. Unless we get... Yeah, quad shot. There we go. That's actually really good. We could have re-rolled it a little bit further, but I like quad shot. Quad shot's beautiful. And with the tiers upgrade we've got thus far, we're actually firing at a decent rate. Now we're getting somewhere. Finally getting somewhere. It's taking a little bit of time. We're already like 25 minutes recording time, so it's taking longer than I wanted to, but we're finally, finally maybe going to start spiraling out of control. Save your key. Save your key for shop slash item room. It's much, much more worth it. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Slow down. I tried to point my light at them and it did not work. We will take the key here. We keep getting like these battery charges or the charges on the D6 I should say back at like the most inopportune times. It was very close to taking damage there. You would not be wrong if you mentioned that fact because it's true it almost happened. Okay, go ahead and continue. Let's get through this floor quickly. I want a quick floor. Yeah, there you go. That's a nice room. Got a black heart somehow. Come on in here. We get proptosis. This is life now. And now there's no reason not to run through the rest of this, because now we are so strong that we can never be defeated. Okay. Pride fight, really? You wanna you wanna do this? You give me a card, you give me a two of diamonds. I'm so appreciative. What a great card. I don't know why I'm suddenly from the Bronx, but we'll continue and uh, go on and do said curves from here. It's so good. Oh my god, we got missing page two. We'll go ahead and re-roll. I re-rolled it and it turned into the same thing. Unless I like unless I really don't know what happened there, I'll be 100% honest, unless the, uh, yeah, I really don't know what happened, I cannot give you an explanation for that. Uh, we tried to press reroll while we took damage, maybe the frames got all messed up and it it didn't work, basically, and unless it rerolled to the same thing, which is maybe also a possibility. We've got like a weird situation here where the longer the tiers travel, they're supposedly going to do more damage with Lump of Coal, but also we don't want them to travel too far because of Proptosis. The closer we are, the more damage we do. Look at the damage. It's so good. It's so good. Yeah, give me Black Candle. But shit about Steam Cell first. I'm a bad man, but that's okay because we don't really have... Uh, just buy the battery charge just in case you don't get enough. Buy the battery charge and then Joker card now? Yeah, and then play this man. Then play this man. He's gonna pay out. This is a good situation. This is where you want to be. Okay, he's gonna pay out with a crappy item. You're gonna pick up Guppy's paw. And you're gonna convert all the way down. Just kidding. Should not have done that. Dumb idea by me. Because now, for some reason, that is not gonna work. Uh, now we can't take this. Reroll everything. Take the goat head. Mm, take the ability to fly, I suppose. I m may have wanted to keep that. Uh, and now, if we can get another charge by the time we go back there, which I don't think is likely. Uh, but if we somehow... Yeah, we're not going to. But if we were somehow able to... Yeah, it's already here. If we were somehow able to, we could buy the Necronomicon uh, for a better deal. Okay, go ahead and continue. We're going to get the Polaroid. We're going to go down to the next floor. Daddy Longlegs is going to just stomp her into oblivion. Continue. Not the, uh, not the, the, the prequel to Skyrim, but you know what I'm talking about. Okay. Okay, continue, continue. Blow up this man, get the lump, get the lump. Take this, we get the deal with the devil. The, I mean, at the bottom line, we we had, we had now have goat head, which is guaranteed deals with the devil for the rest of the game. Would like it if we had some sort of mapping so that we could make these floors go by a little quicker. Not even going to check the pills because, like I said, would like these floors to go by quicker. Demon baby's not a bad pickup, um, but I'd rather just be done. W once you're in a position like this, there's no reason for me to like keep trying to make the run even crazier. We're in a fine enough position here that I should just be content with it. Uh, we're, we're killing rooms real fast, as you can see. So, at this point, uh, we just, you know, thank the game for giving us a better run than last time. We could have, you know, had the same damage we had on the first floor at this point. <laughs> Instead, the game has not blessed us. This is not a... It's pretty much a blessing. Proptosis and, uh... Got some money here. If we can somehow get through the next floors in like three minutes and somehow get a second steam sale which would be difficult to do again not should go pick up those hearts okay should stop taking so much damage though we're not invincible although it is nice that we have permanent port invincibility this time around rather than last time okay go ahead and that guy 
Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Uh, it is nice that we have permanent Polaroid invincibility last time, this time rather than last time where we just kept taking damage in rooms and just died. Okay, yeah, we should stop running into things is what I'm trying to say here. It's, it's a generally a bad strategy to just run into things for no reason. We get two battery charges. We're going to get a library. Uh, hopefully it's a, a book library rather than... Small Rock, thank you so much. Hopefully it's a book library. It is in fact a book library, uh, which is awesome because A, we can get this from this. We can take this. We can take... We can reroll. We can take this. We can take this. We can take this. Now, unfortunately, it's not a big one. It's not a huge book library, but it's decent enough. We'll take the battery charge. We'll come up here. We'll reroll. We'll take this. We'll ta you have to pick them up, otherwise they don't get taken out of the rotation. We're not going to be able to get through all of the all of the books because it's only a two book shop rather than like one of the five book shops. Pick that up. Battery charge, please. No, nope. get a, an item. Anarchist cookbooks. Might as well use it to blow up the guy in the middle. Give us a well. We don't need a better deal with the double chance. We have goat head. But at least blow that mammer jammer up. He gives us another spirit heart. Too kind. Tupac. Uh, if we get another library sometime in the future, it'll probably just have items now. I think we made it through all the books there. There might have been like one more book to get through. Cannot remember off the... Don't think we saw Book of Belial. So we have at least a couple more books to get through. Demon's Tale at this point is probably better. But as I said, I'm on a mission. On a mission to some my transmission and I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Okay, we will use of course the the more pressing reroll is the deal with the devil. Which is what we will do, so we'll go in here. Kill the boss. I forgot that big rooms give you a double charge, which is why we got the, the charge for being done there. Okay, it's champion man. I don't really know what this champion man does that's different than regular man. He will die nonetheless. Show us your yeah, show us the tail. Don't care that I took damage. Oh, I didn't finish him there we get the halo which is fine come on down here empty vessel is also fine I should go back and reroll that room but I'm not going to because I want to put up a sub 40 a sub 40 would be such a happy experience because it's just we don't get those here at Playcrastination we don't get sub 40 runs like ever like like literally you could probably look at my last I'm gonna say at least six videos. You, I, you know what's funny is I think out of like the last ten runs we've done, I think the fastest one we put up was a lost run, which is just contrary to so many things. What do we got in here? Ooh, guppy, 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 guppy. Guppy's hairball. That is guppy. We're not gonna become guppy yet unless one of these contains guppy. Guppy, unless one of these contains Guppy. We are Guppy now, so we will finish the rest of this run in approximately 2.1. We also have Hive Mind, so just get ready to uh, steamroll the rest of the game. I'm just going to run through everything. Don't even want to do this room, so go and continue. Yeah, get out of here. If we don't have to do it, we don't have to do it. If we don't, ha I should say if we don't have to do it, I'm not going to do it. Continue through. You tell me that didn't... Oh, that must be a... A special room of some sort uh, must be like a mini boss in there so we will fight the mini boss I mean we're doing so much damage and might as well see what's in here you never oh it's one of these rooms instead not a mini boss I'm a silly sausage oh it's so good to be alive man this is this is a good time this is when the game you're like thank you you're, you're actually pretty a pr pretty decent person I'm, 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 I'm a fan I remember why I like this game so much continue oh you just go in a room and you just destroy everything another chest yeah maybe but also no just wanna just wanna be done. There you go. Continue with this. Continue with that. Missing out on a lot of items. Don't care. Destroy mom's heart. Yeah, no chance, basically. Already know what's in the deal with the devil. Continue up to cathedral. This is a happy spot to be in. Again, no mapping. Mapping would make things it'd just be like the icing on the cake at this point. But for now, uh, our goal is to make sure we amass... I mean, we don't even need four keys. Asking for four keys so that we can get more items on the chest is just greedy at this point. Because I don't know if you're seeing what's happening. But, but we will, like, at least look for the keys. If they don't show up, they don't show up. Not worth it. This is uh, this is the point where when you're, when you're this powerful, you can be a lot more stingy with, with what rooms you want to do and which ones you don't. And I uh, just don't... Two double golden bombs, you're too kind. You shouldn't have. Uh, nothing to do in this room. No tinted rocks. Just destroy those guys. Destroy those guys. The best part is the flies just take care of most of the business for us. That hurt just a tiny bit. This is good because uh, even if we don't, well, we can't use these unless we get keys. 
yeah, the game, still the key department. Yeah, now it's just like the guppy's tail. Oh my god, and we're gonna get another freaking library. I have to get at least one key to get into the library. Also, golden bomb this. Okay, we got two keys. Do not use it on the golden chest. You think they're worth it. They're never actually worth it. Come on in here. Oh, yeah. Okay, so now we've made it through all the books. So a book of revs and get one of these. We will do this to get one of these. And now we can re-roll all of these like that. Get Cricket's Potty, which is delicious. Re-roll these two. Get Deadeye. Take Sister Maggie for the road. Hello, how you doing? We're in a good spot. Bombs are key. I can open this. Get all these things. And then I can bombs her key, and now we have enough keys for the next floor. And open- Oh, many tears too! Okay, it's all just- It has topped off at this point, basically. Okay, save four. You at least need four keys. Yeah, it's, uh... It has kicked off, as they say. I, I don't know who says that. I think Gavin Free of the Slow Mo Guys has been uh, quoted it in some point in time in his life as saying something along those lines. Don't care. Destroy Isaac. Isaac is- <laughs> It's so- It's just such a textbook difference. And I want you to think of how fast we could have gotten this run done if I would have sped up a little bit earlier. Open that, open that, open that, open that. Uh, I will take Magnetic Tears because it's funny, because it was on the last run, and I was so angry about it showing up because it's such a bad item, and now we are so strong that I want the enemies to be sucked into our tears. We do one more room, and then we get the rerolls necessary. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Now we have the rerolls necessary. Why are we so slow? We have the rerolls necessary to do this and say... Uh, no, don't want one of these. I like the Cricket's body to be able to impact the enemies, and, uh, I don't want it to pierce through them. We lose the Cricket's body, the benefit of the Cricket's body effect in my mind by doing so. Okay, nothing good in here. Just getting up another D6 charge so we can... See, the chest is where you can have a little fun. I told you I wanted to do sub-40, so I got four minutes to have a little bit of fun. I think I've earned it. Four minutes to have a little bit of fun. Nope, no key, or no, uh, battery charge or anything like that. Keys would also be good. Two more rooms, we can come back and reroll those again. Interested maybe in taking a, uh, oh god. He just goes a little cray cray there. Uh, yeah, maybe this is the target we want to reroll instead. It's closer and, uh, and worse basically. So I think that is the target. We will reroll, reroll these three items in here. We will take the 2020, which should mean we're shooting six giant coins at a time now and just wrecking everything. Do you, do you see this? It, this, this is what the Binding of Isaac is meant to be. This is so, this is like so refreshing to, to get a run like this after Torment, essentially. It's just, it's so much, I'm, I'm so happy, basically. Epiphoria, didn't even get to pick it up because we're going so fast, don't care. Now it's the point where, just take me to the boss fight. I've, I've seen all I have, I've had to see on this run. I've seen all I have to see. Hello, blue baby, how you doing? Welcome to hell, basically. Good night, we're gonna hop in the chest. That's a one win streak on our Isaac streets. I hope, streets, waking up. Back on the streets. That's that's I the Isaac. That's a one win streak on a run that started off kind of slow. That is the power of Isaac. All of a sudden, out of nowhere, bam! There's your run. It's awesome. I love it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, uh, make sure to subscribe to become a citizen of Playcraft Nation today. Click the like button if you guys would like to see. Well, I mean, I really care if you guys would like to see this. It's, I mean, it's a democracy, but really, this was. I'm gonna be playing Isaac from now on to bring you guys shorter videos. But thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.